Hello, John here, also known as Venonator, and welcome back to the TGC Tours. So we're into round number two of the Duff Beer Championship at Aberdeen Mining Co. It's the final event of the season, and hopefully, if I make the cut here, we'll be able to carry on. If not, then this is my last TGC Tour round of the season as well. So, fingers crossed we make the cut, but let's see how it goes. But uh, let's see what the settings are like here. Now, the first round I got seven under, by the way, so that's a good start see how we do in round number two so we're on black tees pin set two wind speed medium from the south and we got to fault everything else so the defaults for this um, course are firm fairways firm greens green speeds medium okay so the thing that i had a lot of trouble with in that first round was putting my putting was not ideal i mean looking at it the course is quite tricky i think for putting there's a lot of Hello, bounce like welcome. bumpy greens yeah. Nice so they're not easy to judge by any means that first drive into the fairway and but yeah i was a bit disappointed because i kept hitting some uh, hit quite a few good approach away. shots and, and missed the the pot afterwards a bit of fun here today. but um second shot you know that's first. all under uh, it's the past now so let's focus on round number two that's looking like a pretty good shot i did add a little bit of Here's an 18 foot. Yeah, putt. I did add a little bit of distance to it. So I think someone's just doing something with fireworks outside or something. It sort of startled me for a second. I was not expecting oh, it. Just right by the hole. And this one for the par. There we go. Okay. okay seven under so par it's a par to start with. That's quite a tricky one to get a birdie on, by the looks of it. It's a bouncy green. From bouncy green, a bumpy green. Side. Okay, so the wind is pulling this to the left. Should be okay because there's a big mound here that pull it out of the way. And this not the easiest. Two hundred forty-five yard mark. Yeah, not the easiest um, area to hit it from. The lie isn't great. Hit it slow, which isn't ideal. Okay, I mean it's all right. This is your third shot. That's a pretty good chip. It's a little bit further away than I'd like it to be. <sighs> Didn't want to turn there. That's a shame. So that's a par on a par five because I miss hit that one shot. But ugh, that putt was, it wasn't the best putt. You can see the putt path was, um, wasn't great there. It's a shame really, but okay. We've got plenty of time to, to make up for that though. Would absolutely love to make the cut for this final event. We've got about 120 yards to get to that pin from here. Okay, so the wind really pulled that more than I expected it to. Yeah, fireworks are going out off crazy in the background. Okay. Could be a birdie on the score. Which is not ideal, me trying to record here and a minute ago, there's a big festival thing when it came to the music, and now they're finishing with fireworks by the looks of it. What a putt effort that was. That's a shame. If that would have been the, an eagle putt there, that would have been fine. Yeah, sorry if you can't hear a word I'm saying, because it is really loud here. And teeing off now in a long par four. Okay, so I just hit that with full power. Hoping it'll get over the bunker, and it has. Pretty good. So I hit it perfectly. The lie and the um, the wind did not help that, but not a bad effort in the end. Pretty good. Putt appears to be online. Oh, too much pace on that one. Okay, so the putting woes continue. Having the same trouble as we had in the first round when it comes to putting at the moment. Let's try and stay positive. And the headwind is definitely a thing on this hole. I'm not giving up yet. 171. So the wind's really going to pull this back. I'm actually... Great swing Go on, on that. this here. 
Well, that's too bad. I'm uh, pretty sure you weren't planning on that. It's okay. Okay, so that's a pretty good effort. It's close. Good job with that chip. chip. It's only a par again, but it's a good, it's a good one. Under par after that hole. Yeah, not not bad. Not a great start. Five five pars in a row. But we're keeping six. that score going. We got we got plenty of time to get a better well to get a better score. So three hundred and seven. So this is, and I'm going to go with this. Going Fireworks are incredibly distracting, <laughs> but we seem to be okay. I think that stopped now. Anyway, look at this drive in the green and. Uh... Got a putt for Eagle coming up. That's all right. Drop this one for Eagle. Let's do it. Okay, so. Just a little three footer left for this one. Yeah, it's all right. I mean, I didn't have much to say about that, as you could see. Okay, we got our first birdie of the round on hole number six. But you know what? That's okay. We got a birdie now. Stepping on to a par four hole. On one under one. or eight under overall. This course is tricky. The putting is hard on this course, even though I was saying my putting's been temperamental. And this one's around it is a tough course away. for that. So, 102%, that's good. That's all I needed, really, right the with the wind pulling it back. Unfortunately, I hit oh, it too uh, right. It's okay. okay third shot. Went a bit aggressive with my chip shot there. This is okay. potentially to save par. So far, so good. Yep, there we go. We got a That's par from it. Needed in there for par. Okay, so one under through seven. After that hole, eight under par. Let's keep plugging away, try and get a decent score, and just make this cut here, really. But yeah, we've got a, quite a few good shots going on anyway. I'm, I'm happy with certain areas of how we're playing here. That was a nice tempo, etc. Oh, just a bit too Second far. Second shot here on hole number eight. Oh, a bit short with the chip. It's right, dangerous. Drop this on in and save your par. Well, it's heading towards the hole. Ah, uh, and fast no, too. Tough. Uh, a little bit, a little bit too hard on that one. Surprisingly. Okay, so we've lost our bird. <laughs> this is a full. No, not good. But, um. Okay, so let's keep going. Heads up, winds blowing left to right here. Definitely have the abilities to bring this back. Had very good half a round nice before. Shot. I've got like eight or nine under on this on this one half of a round before, which is actually very good when that happens. That happened very often. I'd be I wouldn't be in CCG. But you never know. You never know what could happen. Here we go. This drops and you get a bird. But yeah, it's just bringing all of the game together, really. Get there. And that is a place to start. That's a fantastic put and just what we needed. Okay, so we're back to one under. So we've got a one under front nine. Okay, eight under par is your score currently. That's a great way to redeem that bogey. So really positive. Start the back okay, nine well. Up now on the so it's a par four. Hit it a bit fast. There's a bump there. Could make it go into the rough, and it hasn't. We've got. We've done. Yeah, that's good. That's exactly what we need. So I added loft nice to that. Idea. It's made it a bit short. Okay, this one's 20 feet. It's pretty good. Oh, yes, so just. Good. Thank you very much. There you go. Shot. Okay, that's two good putts in a row when we needed them. And you're sitting right there at nine under par. Okay, so two hole. under now. Bit of concentration went a long way there. It's just about enough, but it was enough. So that's that's the thing to focus on. Here we go, par four in front of us. Okay, 
fairway, so the wind's going to pull this back quite a lot here, but right into the middle of the fairway. Oh, yeah. So I think I'll, that's good. I'll, uh, I'll approve that. This one's about a hundred yards. Ah, this is my in. range where the clubs don't quite work out when it comes to my club choices. I don't have a nine iron, so certain pitch shots. The range, I don't have the range in between, but what's it, the 14 footer. one of the pitching wedge, one of them, and um, and the eight iron. Well, not a bad effort oh. again. And this is your look at par. Please with that. That was pretty good, pretty good going, and it made it at the par a lot easier, so it's a good effort. Yeah, 200 through 11, but yeah, we're doing really well on this back nine. Right to left out there. Okay, so this one, so we're looking at 8 up, so 158. The wind and the club will probably cut this back a little bit. It's looking good. It's a little bit long, but I'm not complaining about that one. Yeah, that'll play. It's a good shot. Here is a 12-footer. Oh, it's getting there. It's a little bit no, too right bumpy. Hole, isn't it? Okay, this one for par. Okay. I mean, okay, I'm, I'm happy with that one, too. Score. That was a good approach shot. It was a hard birdie. It's a bit it's a bit of a difficult green, that one. I mean, the greens in this on this course hole, are yeah. difficult anyway. Okay, so it's bouncing past all this bumpy hill stuff. As long as it's quite flat here, we'll be okay. Okay, it's decent. It's good enough. See how far this gets. This is looking pretty good. Went a bit too far, but how unpredictable it is the best green. Trying to get that accurate is not easy. In under regulation. Well done. And this one is for the... See what this does as it goes down wings. this hill. Snaking around. It's looking pretty good. That's nice. And there you go. Got a birdie. That was a nice putt to get that that close. Okay, after that we did well with a lot of that. Getting um, the fairway woods to, to stop. Or, you know, not bounce away from the green once you hit it is pretty difficult on its own. So, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. Hit that too fast. The wind hopefully will pull it to the right. And it's gone down this hill quite a bit as well, which is nice. Okay, yeah, that's that's fine. Yards to the pin. So it's 18 feet down. So we're looking at six down, so 164. Okay, so I've got 155 there. Um, means that'll go a little bit further than it's supposed to there. 98%. And that'll do. Okay. Grab your putter. And just put this one in. It's, it's home. good enough. A long way from home, but I have faith. It's looking nice. It's going to go to the right, unfortunately, because the... Hey, that was a the beads were going that way. From way out there. Yeah, but we got close. And after that one, ten under. So yeah, ten under. So three under at this stage. Three under. We got four holes to go. Okay, this hole we got a tailwind to deal with. Nicely done. You got some good contact there. That's another good tee shot. All right, we got an elevated green. Might need some more club. Right, okay. This is a difficult one to figure out. So we've got what, eight up, essentially. So 130. The wind, how much is that going to push onto this lob shot? That's the question. Unfortunately, the lie made that very difficult. That'll do for the approach. Here we go. This is for birdie. I can see why there's a lot of eagle opportunities on this course because you're relying on the lie a lot for these short these birdies, and there's a lot of par three 
awkwardness as well. At 10 under par at the moment. Okay, it's 10 under. Will that be enough to make the cut? That's very questionable. Off on a par I don't three. think so. Well, this could oh, maybe dear. roll its way into the rough, possibly. Not a good shot, unfortunately. Well, that's all right. We'll get on the green next time. Okay, this is actually a really shot difficult shot. So. Oh. so, because of that, I'll probably put it up here. Ah, uh, no, it's going way too far. Okay, so we're going to get a bogey at the end here as well, which is not good. Okay. All right, drop this par putt. Let's do it. It's definitely a course I should have practiced on, I think, before um, I started these. It's a tricky, uh, bouncy course. Oh. That's not a bad effort. No. Okay, we're moving. We're moving to the next. But yeah, I'm not disappointed in the way I played. Played pretty well in certain areas. It's just missed opportunities, a lot of them. It really cost me. At the end of the day, if this is where my TGC Tour season ends, fair enough. Second shot on the 17th. Oh, it's done that again. It's, it's, why is it doing that? Very disorientating when it does it. Okay. So I've accidentally hit that way to right. This is what our third shot's looking like. That's a good chip. Great effort. I'm liking that one. Nice chip. Great okay. work. That's your fifth birdie today. Okay. There you go. So we got we got a birdie there. So we've got one hole left and we're at ten under. So we're only three under for this round. Wind's blowing right in it's our a disappointing one, one, definitely. But um I'm not gonna be too up um pessimistic about it all. Yeah, drive's looking decent here. Ah, uh, bunker. Oh, sorry, we ended up in the sand. And from the bunker. On the right side, that's a good swing path. The downside, it is way too fast. I like what you did there. Out of that fairway bunker, you got some distance on that, too. Yeah, pretty pretty decent there. Okay. Coming through with a the perfect chip. tempo chip shot, which is nice. Okay, the Three under round. Derailed the whole thing, I think, unfortunately. Great stuff. What am I going to say? It's a shame. That's probably the end of the TGC Tours for me. Um, what will happen if I don't make the cut here? I'll probably... I don't know. I'll probably do the casual round this week. And I'll probably try and make the TGC Tour video that I was going to make. Which basically explains what, how far I've come and all that sort of thing. See the progress I've made. But yeah, that's it then. So I'll see you next time. Probably for a casual round, I'm going to be honest, 10 under is probably not going to cut it. But um, yeah, I'll see you soon. Goodbye.